he claims he can make the triangle's electronic fog at home. But since Hutchison almost never reproduces his Hutchison effect on command, he's got video as proof. So you triangle believers say Hutchison's strange effects are pure triangle evidence. But is the evidence real? Skeptics Tom Flynn and Joe Nickel think not. Here's the 7-Up bottle flip. And they think they know just how it's done. Okay, and off it goes. It's so peculiar, so unlike what a human cameraman would normally do, that this bottle goes flying away, and the camera doesn't want to follow it. So the assumption is that it, uh, it couldn't follow it. There might have been something up there that you wouldn't want to see. Their guess? Some... One pulling strings. But Hutchison claims his experiments come with no strings attached. This buster gets laughing because how are you going to use strings in, in a full scale um, levitation experiment when you have uh, television people around and scientists who do control experiments? video was shot in what appears to be a garage or a basement workroom. It's got a beige concrete floor and there's stains and cracks. And it's kind of variegated. Uh, and the nice thing about that, if you're doing something with filament line, is that that kind of background is very easy to lose the line against. I've rigged this bottle so that I have a control. Uh, it's fastened at the bottom and it's fastened at the top with filament. And this is going to be what we call the puppet effect. Here you could probably see the fish line against my solid colored trousers. And yet if I step away quickly, the line vanishes. Whenever you're ready, Joe, let's start the wobbling. Okay, stand by to apply it. Nickel and Flynn have imitated Hutchison's jumping soda bottle with a simple magic trick. But can